First three-pointer of the game won't go. That was Jarrett Culver, who's been around the block, still just 25 years old. G.G. Jackson from way downtown. <laughs> Interview by Shaq and just went into straight all from the standpoint that he was talking to Shaquille O'Neal as he's able to get the friendly bounce, three. knocking down his second three. Of course, Marcus Smart being in the fold where they didn't have him two seasons ago where they were the two seed in the West. Jackson with the lefty finish plus the foul. But we will know one guy that they're going to be looking. You see Jet getting some playing time for the big club this I year? I do. I do. I really do. His ability to shoot the basketball. And again, it's different when you're a rookie. G.G. Jackson, of course, crashing the board. Had a great rookie season. Jet's ability to shoot the basketball and, and just take away a little bit of that pressure from Paolo Bancaro, from Fonz Bach. Those guys that open up the floor for them to be able to get to the basket, especially with Paolo. And Paolo, we, we talked a lot about their roster makeup and how excited he is for what the Magic have, and not only their young players, but also bringing in KCP, the veteran who... You can't hurt your wrist when you do that. No. Safety first. That's why Melo did it. Don't want to shoot that, hurt that shooting hand. G.G. Jackson in a crowd. Doesn't matter. Lefty finish. 22 points for G.G. Jackson. That ends a 13-0 run. Make it to the playoffs. G.G. Jackson like a running back straight through the lane. And he's really been the answer for everything that the Grizzlies have needed throughout this game. And her watching Jet. Now, that's her baby. We, we know about his baby. You look at him, of course, as a player having been through that. But how is Janine now having the opportunity to watch her?